guys. Okay, back with my shoe. Um, I've just uh, finished sellotaping it. Well, to, to what I need it to. Okay, so once you get to this stage where you uh, have sellotaped the full thing and you're comfortable with how it is, this is how we take it off the shoe. Now be really careful, I'm going to use uh, little scissors um, because they're, they're on dear. Now what I usually do is I pull the cellophane back up from the sides, if you can. Some of mine stuck to it I think. There we go. Now what you can do is when you've pulled the sellotape up like so, just back it on itself so it sticks to the cellophane then you are faffing about and it's getting on your nerves and things like that so I just take it back on itself so it sticks now once you've pulled all the sides out pull out the underneath as well where you've done and same technique put the thing under it so it don't you know take the sticky, sticky tape back on itself so it don't get on your nerves so you're left with this opening. Now what we're going to do is I'm going to cut down here. Okay. Now this is why we have the cellophane on underneath because it protects the shoe when you cut him. So if you get in there and just cut. I'm not going to go right to the bottom. I'm just going to go a little bit away and as you're doing that Track, be careful because you will when you're opening it you will rip it now a lot of people do these and the cut down here as well I found that if you cut I'm gonna cut a little bit more down there but if you cut you know a bit down you don't have to cut the front because you show with a bit of manipulation comes out by itself I mean, you know, you've got to give it a bit of manipulation because you, you just you've, then you've just got to cover up two up two. Then is where you've cut, you know, two cut marks with a bit of manipulation. It comes out. Look, and there you go. And then it's just a case from then just to tidy it up a bit. You know, put that back under there. Now you do have to be careful because putting on, I don't know how many you've put, I think I, I haven't put that much on them to be fair. But tuck it all back in and you know straighten it out a little bit. And if you find that your shoe is still a little bit weak, this one is still a little bit weak, just continue with a sellotape. All you do with the back is just get it up to where, you know, as even as you can, you know. Um, and you know straighten it out and then just put a bit of sellotape on it get it as even and as together as you can and sellotape it and really it's just as simple as that and in fact it go very straight try again And you just, you know, you sellotape your shoe back down. Uh, the bits on the side, obviously, they're going to be, so just sellotape them down. And underneath, obviously. Because if not, they're just going to do your head in. <laughs> Been flapping about. And... But make sure you get this, you know, the shape of your shoe before you start tying it down inside. Because it really is a nightmare to get back up if you've done it wrong. Um, you know you can I'm not saying you can't you can but if you do the shape of the shoe first it's much better they are and you know just put some more sellotape on it and there you are now I'm going to put some more, more sellotape on this um, and straighten it out a little bit and this and that but you can do what you like now now the one that I have done I covered the tape up some people use material um, some people use paper, um, some use book book pages, the, the decoupage it with book pages. Um, I have done one like that, but the latest ones that I've been doing, I covered them in washi tape. 
um, you know, I found it better because when you're doing paper and material, it's a bugbear to get it under the eel and stuff like that. And it's just, it's the same with the, with the book pages, to be fair. Um, and it's just a nightmare to get it under and over the eel and stuff like that. So, washi tape, much easier. So, that's your shoe. And, like I say, you can decorate it how you like. You've seen how I've done them. Uh, the rolled roses and the other flowers are also on the YouTube channel, so check them out. They'll tell you how to do them if you want to know how to do them. Also, there's some um, paper, book paper um, flowers on there as well um, that I actually come across by accident. So I've done a tutorial for them for anybody that uh, wants that. And there's your shoe, and that's all you do. Cellophane on and just cover it in plastic plastic, cover it in um, sellotape, silly wrappy, cut down the back, it depends on the shoe as well, you know, where you cut, obviously, that kind of shoe, just cut down the back as you saw me do, and take it off like that, some other shoes might be a little bit awkward, like if it's fully in, if the shoe is like fully covered to there, then you are going to have to cut down, to the, uh, down the middle, but there you go, and it's ready to decorate. So thanks for watching guys, please subscribe and I'll catch you a bit later on. Right guys, see you soon. Bye.